In this video, we're going to learn how to load kits, sounds, and instruments in iMachina 2. Welcome to the Mobile Producer. Learn how to make music anywhere you want and make it faster and easier than ever before. My name is Benji, and if you haven't already, please subscribe now. Let's get into it. In this tutorial, you will learn how to load a kit to a group in pads mode. Open the performance view by tapping its button in the mid-left of the view navigation pane. Select the group in pads mode. Open the side panel library browser by tapping its button in the view navigation pane. Ensure the file type selector is set to kits and the content selector to factory content. Select the kit by tapping its name. The kit is loaded and you can now play it on the pads. To load a sample to an empty pad of the blank project, proceed as follows. Select an empty pad. Open the side panel library browser by tapping its button in the view navigation pane. Ensure the file type selector is set to samples. Set the content selector factory content or user content. Navigate through the folders and select a sample by tapping its name. The current pad will light with the group color. The sample is loaded to the pad. In this tutorial, you will learn how to load an instrument or a sample to a group in the keys mode. Open the performance view by tapping its button in the mid-left of the view navigation pane. Select a group in keys mode. Open the side panel library browser by tapping its button in the view navigation pane. Enable the file type selector instruments or samples in the content selector factory content or user content. Navigate through the folders and select an instrument or sample by tapping its name. The instrument or sample is loaded and you can now play it on the keys. You can also record your voice or other sounds from the iPad's microphone via the loop recorder. Select a group in the loop recorder mode. iMachina 2 must be allowed to access the iPad's microphone to record audio. Make sure you enable the respective option in your iPad settings. To record a loop, begin singing, clapping, or whatever you want to record. When you feel ready, tap the record button in the header. The countdown begins. When you're done, tap the record button again to stop recording. The recorded audio will be played back together with the other groups. Note, in loop recorder mode, the metronome can only be enabled when headphones are connected to the iPad. You will then hear the metronome from the headphones. We just learned how to load kits, sounds, and instruments in iMachina 2. If you have questions, feel free to leave them in the comments below. If you haven't already, please subscribe and turn on notifications so you know when new videos drop. Thanks for watching.